Hello everybody, I'm at Walgreens. I work here every Thursday. Let me tell you about the using the ways of the economy today and want to give a lot of m m millennials advice. If you like to start your own small business, try start it out doing a part-time or full-time job at some stores or factories. You need to do like little by little, step by step, and also like save a little money at a time. And then when you start getting like more ideas after you get to know a lot of people and learn how the business works. You start to get some ideas and start building like little products and bring out samples. And as growing number of people start to like your products, you start to make a little more, make it into a sale. And as you start increasing A lot of money, little, a lot of money going from small to big. You start to make a success even more and start buying, buying a warehouse and start building a business. That's how the eco opportunity starts, from rag to rich. So. When you started, started to learn all things, that's how you become successful. Not just hard work, but free thinking. Wait, that didn't sound right. That didn't sound right. Anyway, it's really good to have businesses. As long as you gotta have common sense. What this country should need is nationalization of marketing system along with common sensible laborism, ethical consumerism, authentic distributism, and cryptographic monetarism. Cryptographic monetary is is a type of system that you can it, a lot of people can access into the cryptocurrencies such as bit, bitcoins, dog coins, and even pot coins, which is connected to the cannabis deposit depository. Also for the for the early workers, you probably can, especially for part-timers, you can probably start out by activating a bit walking. It's like how much miles could you go and earn a little bit more money. Even for stay-at-home moms or dads, which is good help too. When you did a lot of work around the house and while you're using that bit walking, you probably could earn a little more money too. And I can imagine about you can also probably set up like a what I could call it bit flex because not only you could try walking, but hopefully they could set up the like a flexible sensor. So to see how much flexibility do you get to earn a little money. Not only you could earn the money, you could also it also help to lose weight and also gain muscles. Speaking of lose weight. Most of the jobs are not only 
earning, but also helps to lose a lot of weight too, physically and mentally. I met a person that works at Dunkin' Donuts. He was he was like me, heavyweight, until he started working at Dunkin' Donuts, especially he became a manager. He's been working every day, making a best movement. He he lost a lot of weight and gained a lot of muscles since then. I'm pretty impressed. I'm part timer and I don't lose weight a lot, but I do work around at at my house, doing laundry, putting dishes away, cleaning dishes. Also cleaning my room, make my bed. Also, sometimes tidy up around the kitchen and the living room. Also my brother's room. That really helps to feel the burn on in me. If I ever set up a bed walking and doing a lot of things like that, I would lose weight and gain a little money, which it would help. Also, for the nationalization of marketing, it would be good because it would help to provide more job creations while setting up a indirect payment with cryptocurrencies and also you can barter and fed and using fed trade agreements between the nations while trying to keep jobs within our own nation which it should be Also, good thing that we can, good thing we should, no, we should have the hemp industry so we could make it like a hemp plastics in order to make toys, bottles, vehicles, instead of like, instead of harding to find minerals these days. Yeah, if I ever study and get a degree to want to want a hemp plastic, play hemp plastic like that, I would make a lot of money to build a best company and hired a lot of people along with cryptocurrencies and indirect payment. Blockchain, block, blockchain technology, which is pretty good. Also, a lot of factories these days are stuck, keep on relying on those automated machines and no workers, which is pretty bad for their health. Laziness is really bad for your health. So I suggest we move as much machines as possible and hired a lot of people while setting up a indirect payment with cryptocurrency and blockchain technology. And also add the bit walking and bit flex along with it too, just to make a little extra. Like God put Adam on earth, not only he put Adam on earth to be in charge of the garden, but also have to work with hand, work with bare hands to make a success to please God and also make a su successfully a bodybuilding, <laughs> unlike me. Long before the, 
long before the curse came upon them. Yeah, so handwork is handwork and craftsmanship is a lot better than relying on machines though every time. But you can rely on little machines to work along with the workers, not replace them. That's how the way it's supposed to be. Stay using common sense, my fellow Americans. God bless.